What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We've got Colby here. We've got the 7.3 back. Uh, today's a special day. Tire and wheel review and reveal for the 2021 Honda Rubicon DCT. Let's get right into it. Hey, six hours back too. Six hours back, yeah, that's right. Seven threes back. We'll go over everything we did with it, but uh, stay tuned. And we have no idea where the GoPro is, so we're going to try and get Colby to video for us. Um, the reveal. Here's the 21 looking good looking good we've got the almighty beautiful odis we've got 13 miles on her 14 something like that but uh we'll get these special wheels and tires mounted up give you guys a quick shot brand new 160 dollar ford plug just totally foobard unbelievable so we're gonna go ahead and get straight into it i'm gonna show you guys the tires bummed or happy bummed or happy these are uh itb hurricanes Four, or, uh, 12 inch wheels of 27s uh, these are the itp mudlight 2.0 we're gonna go ahead and video this before it gets dark we can work with the trucks in the dark um something a little bit modest nothing too crazy but uh we'll get them mounted up i wish i could do a time lapse for you but i can't uh we'll get you guys mounted up and then i'll show you what they're all about colby said he saw the tripod but anyways what you're gonna need for this is an extension well, you might not even need that. All you really need is a deep 14 and a deep 17. 17 for stocks, 14 for the new wheels. Because that's what the aftermarket lug nuts are like. 12 point because we're bad like that. Tell me that does not look good. She's got the new tire smell going on. That looks good. Hope you guys like that. Along with the 3,500 pound winch. Bad to the bone, boys. So the smart thing to do would be to put all these tools away before we just get into riding it. And that's not what we're gonna do. Oh, and look how much higher rides. Dang, why is it tooted up backwards? Redonkulous. Oh, we probably have lots of PSI on tire. I bet they're like 30 PSI. Probably. Watch your drill. Not to damn grace. Yes, sir. How's she look? Jump on the back. Okay. All right, boys. Here she is in all her glory. Uh, as far as the automatic goes, it seems to shift just fine. No difference there. Power-wise, you can't even tell these are there. Uh, we'll have to see in the mud, but I'm sure that they're fine because they are only a 27. They are kind of a heavy 27. They've got way too much air in them right now, but uh, looks pretty dope. Well, let's take her down to the hill climb. You video the hill climb? I guess. I, I know I don't have a comparison for stocks, but if you want comparison for stocks, go back to all my other videos where every group's going to have it on stocks. About rolled the brand new four wheeler. Uh -huh. Now we 
Holy Jesus. Been nice on new paint. What? It would been nice on new paint. Not too bad. Yes, I get you. Our uh, test down here is going to see how deep that hole is for us. Get us a gander. Zoom out. This is a good feature here. So they can get you a gander. Go ahead. We're going to start checking PSIs. I know they mounted them. They didn't put them at lower PSI. They're at 25 probably at least. Hey, we've already did quite a bit of riding, and I got less miles than Josh Bowles had when he bought it. Look how fat that rear end is. It probably ain't that slick. He's gonna see how deep it is. I kind of want to know how bad the suction is too. You're almost in the middle, surely not. Hit the next step, see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> on the mission for a long stick aren't you bud that'll work you won't do it but anyways guys this is where i'm gonna end the video hope you guys enjoyed please leave a like and subscribe for more content on the rubicon we will keep you guys updated we will keep videos rolling out for you guys as much as i can and uh thanks for watching See how soggy it is. <laughs> Go over there. I'm curious how these. <laughs>